Aloha everyone. Tiki Andy and Jay here. Uh, it's just Wednesday in the middle of May. Quarantine's still going on, but uh, we're going to do a LA and Hollywood adventure, so bring your face masks. Come along with us. It's going to be fun. Decided to come check out the new SoFi Stadium due to open this fall. Home of the LA Chargers and the LA Rams. You can barely see it peeking out over those houses. But it's really going to show up right here when we get to this red light. See many construction crews working here and there it is. to the pass but figured I'd take a trip down this road before filming just so I know what I'm working with. Here's some good views of it right here. If you look right there through those columns, don't know if you could see it that well but there's a bunch of seats there that will have butts in them hopefully this fall. Hopefully this coming December, I'll be in one of those seats, rooting on the Falcons against the Chargers. Cool. And it's right across from the iconic forum. Right on. Adventures continue. There's downtown LA. Next. Here we are, getting off at James M. Woods Boulevard. We're at a red light, but there's downtown LA again, going back in. Dodger Stadium somewhere out there on a hill. We won't go out that way. There's a freeway. What's up where? Nothing. Okay. And there's Clifton's really cool tiki bar in there that we have yet to go to. We're here on Broadway. We had a really cool date here a few years ago. Uh, randomly happened upon a art festival, so that was cool. More views of Broadway and downtown. We're out walking around now. Just parked the car. We'll be here for about less than an hour. We're going over to Grand Central Station, see if we can find something good for lunch. We're in Grand Central Market. Just a bunch of restaurants. Of course, no seating, no seating. But yeah, a bunch of restaurants just uh, deciding what to eat. Out of all the food places that are available here at the Grand Central Market, we got food at Golden Road. Uh, so yeah, she got a burger, I got a chicken sandwich. They're probably really good, but. No beer, unfortunately, because, well, you have to take it to go, and we're still on adventure, so... Yeah, we can't drive around and drink beer. Boo! There is the iconic Angel's Flight. It's a little trolley that takes you up the hill. We're gonna go across. I don't think it's running. Nope, they're sitting right there, right in the middle. And there's the tall U.S. Bank building. There's the slide. Right there. Oh, this is our lunch. Fried chicken sandwich right here. Ooh, there's bacon, fries. We're here in my car and there's her burger with her salad. We got a Coke. Yeah. Just enjoying what we can. Okay, yeah, I know we were kind of lame picking Golden Road over all those mom and pop shops in Grand Central, but that fried chicken sandwich was pretty good. Her burger ended up being really good. We ended up switching three-fourths of the way through. Something like that? I don't know. We ended up liking each other's more. <laughs> but Golden Road, <laughs> Golden Road has some good food, so... Yeah. I think next time, though, I'll definitely choose something else. But, uh... Alright, our time is up on the little meter, so... It's time to head off. I've always wanted to come and see this.
the Fast and Furious house, the Toretto's house. 722, there it is. All right, that's enough. Hey, I'm now, right I'm not filming anyone else except me, but Bob's Market, also known as the famous Toretto's in the Fast and Furious, just down the street from the, where the house is, right over there. So this is really cool. We just went in there and bought a couple things, but why don't you give yourself a fat burger with fries for $2.95? And we're back on Hollywood Boulevard. There's some of the stars walk of fame right there. Just driving around. Not that much traffic. Decided to stop in Studio City to visit the Tonga Hut, but looks like they're closed. Oh well. Another time when all this is over. Also, while we were in the area, decided to check out Tiki No. Right here on Lakershim. Seems pretty cool. But I think we're going to end up at Kahuna, which is just down the street, for some food. And look over there. Super silly fun land. Just over those trees. Check it out, Universal Studios. We're getting off and we're gonna go drive by it. Let's see how much we can drive through at Universal Studios. Probably not all that much, but uh, yeah. We're here, Universal. Ah. I'm being careful with my phone because there's a cop literally right under the Universal City sign. Okay, here we go. All right, so we just saw the Cloud9 store from Superstore. Here's the Warner Brothers lot. We were here a few years ago with our friends to watch Undateable Live. And uh, it was really cool. Our friend Jerry got picked to be on the show in his shark costume. So, yeah, I would love to come here and do a tour of it sometime. Our final stop is Kalua. Kahuna Tiki. And check this place out. Check this out. Jalen's looking at a menu. But this is cool. Wow. They even have an Xbox right here. Huh. That's funny. So here's the Tiki bar, the Leaky Leaky Tree. More seating area back here, obviously closed. Looks like they have a stage back here, another waterfall. Another water feature over here. Like this is really cool. I wanna come back here with friends. Oh, not maybe not a stage, I don't know. But yeah, this is so cool. We're now ending our day, camped out in our little chairs. <laughs> Drinks, food in front of Elena's house. And we brought her a pool. There she is. <laughs> oh yay, she brought us TV tray. Yay. Wow. So I get why. Like I'm scared for my dad. Like I'm scared. He's over sixty-five. Look at that sunset. Jalen, what'd you think of uh Kahula Kahuna Tiki. The spam grilled cheese is really good. Yeah. The fries not so much, but only because we drove 25 minutes, 20, 30 minutes. To see Delena. Um, yeah, the moment was good. Yeah. That it was, was fiery. That was my favorite. That was his favorite. Yeah. Tsunami roll? A tsunami roll. All of this probably would have been a lot better if we were actually there enjoying the meal not having to take it take out it would probably would have been better fresh same with the drinks you know painkiller was probably a little watered down but good it's good i like it yeah so that's tsunami roll kona tiki we will definitely be back definitely if we're ever in the la area again get together with friends like that friend right there elena All right, now it's fri Friday, May 22nd, and I'm here at Network. 
brewery to pick up my it's upside down but the virtual beer fest pick it up right back there free in and out ah yes beautiful downtown seal beach we are now walking around hopefully if all goes well we will be dining in dining in at hennessy's grill looks like there's people chilling out here 321 320 sorry it's exciting because they just passed uh phase two here in orange county so we'll see how busy they are definitely a lot of cars and people out about exciting we're here at hennessy's waiting in line we're second in line notice the please keep six feet apart sign and there's jalen Hi. face covering required for your safety all persons wearing a face covering at all times Except while you're dining, like these people right here. We're now sat at a table. Yeah, this is exciting. Tennessee's. Mm. Window view. What? It's pretty interesting. It's like half capacity. It's ISO. Yeah. I'll show you guys. So no one's at the bar, and then the next table, they're like six feet apart from us there's a table over there and there's people over there so it's pretty cool pretty cool so i guess our first server screwed up because we're supposed to get these paper menus we got radio menus so now the menu is a little less less still exciting though yeah still excited <laughs> Starting off with a Bloody Mary, five dollars. Can't beat it. What was that you just said? Which one? What you just said. This could be the worst Bloody Mary we've ever had. We wouldn't know it. Yeah, and that we're at a table drinking drinks together in a restaurant. No. Nope. Look at this salad. I mean, here's my hand for comparison. That looks pretty good. So over there. pretty good salad. Yeah. Uh, got a raspberry lemonade vodka. Jalen got the same drink. There's her burger. That looks good. So coming back from the bathroom, but this is how empty the restaurant is. Like, still pretty packed, but all these tables pushed to the side. No one at the bar. We're sitting way back there. There's Jalen. So, pretty good. Pretty good setup. This Raspberry vodka lemonade looks so good. It actually is really good. I already had one, but now they put it in a cooler glass. I am ending our meal today with a half and half of Guinness and Harp and a shot of Proper 12 Irish whiskey. This looks so good. Well, guess who surprised me with the Jaeger shot? Yeah, she did. I thought that was done by now, but um, this is my second half and half, and a Coors. I mean, look at the size difference. And? I had another shot, because she bought me the shot. They only had two shots. Two shots. Oh, that was Jaeger, Jaeger whiskey. And she got another lemonade vodka. So, yeah. So it's kind of a celebration. It's like first time we could go out and actually get food and drinks since the quarantine, so yeah. we might be going overboard. A couple of videos back, a couple of videos back, we went to the Abbey and we took food outside, but the Abbey is like right down the street, a little bit that way. Um, but we got to enjoy beers while we were there waiting for our food. And then we went across the street, went to the benches, had the food. So that was the closest we got to dining in. That was a few weeks ago. This is actually dining in. This is great. <laughs> it's the little things. So you don't realize how much you miss it until it's gone. And then the second you can have it back, it's like, yes, please. 
So to put this in simple terms for anyone who doesn't understand, here's our table right here, right? Here's Jalen. Here's our window. Your I your table is your island. Once you leave your table, your island, your island, you put your mask on. You're going to the bathroom way back there. Put your mask on. It's that simple. But at your table, eating some French fries, drinking a beer, no mask needed. No. So we finally left Tennessee's. We're walking towards the beach. And uh, they have a sign that says, Beach in Motion. That means you have to keep walking. According to Jalen, she said that. And I also bought myself a Dodgers Hawaiian shirt. For $93. Yeah, but it was worth it. $93. It was worth it. Anyway. Yeah. We're going to go walk to the beach. Because we can. Well, that was great eating out at a... Uh, Hennessy's? Hennessy's. Hennessy's was really good. She bought me too many drinks, so sorry. Three shots. He's so, had too many. Three shots of Jaeger. It, it's been nice because the last time we ate out was pretty much two months ago at Bar Louie in Santa Ana, Tustin. 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 We went and saw Birds of Prey. I think Birds of Prey. So or Onward. Onward. Yes, Onward. We saw Onward. onward. Which was great. You guys should all check it out. It's on Disney Plus now. Ha! Huh, not sponsored. Also, downtown LA, fantastic. Driving through Universal Studios, I've seen all the houses. I love the Fast and Furious, so I'm finally glad I saw that. And. Charmed House! Yep. It's not in the vlog, but we went by it and the Thriller House. He'll add it to the vlog. Yeah, maybe. And all that stuff. So, thank you all for checking it out. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you like it. Doesn't matter. Love y'all. Be safe and hello. Ha. Celebration tonight. Celebrate one more time. One more time. One more time. You just got me feeling so free. We're gonna celebrate. Celebrate and dance so free. One more time. You just got me feeling so free.